I made first flights of my new AMA beta this morning and early afternoon from a frozen lake near my house. I have to say this plane is really stable. The climb was not really fast, but I would compare it to flying the Sky Bunny on 3 sixteenths rubber. Most of my flights were on 800 turns using the included 20 to 1 winder. I think you could get in a few more turns, but I was a little afraid of losing it in a thermal if it got up much higher. Also, it was only about uh, 35 degrees, so the rubber wasn't as efficient as it could be when it was warmer, but it did pretty good. The color scheme probably isn't the best for flying off of a frozen lake with snow on it, but uh, I always was able to find it. Here's a comparison of the Beta and the Alpha. My Alpha has an electric motor on it now. Here is part of a flight with the electric motor on the Alpha. It climbs fairly fast. Here's a close-up of the Beta. It has a rather unique stabilizer. It looks kind of like a George Perryman idea. The Beta comes in an attractive box that has plenty of reading to do on the outside of the box. Uh, there's information about the AMA and about teaching STEM through model aviation. Looking inside the box, everything is well packed and there's an included 20 to 1 winder. Here you see the 7 inch propeller and two sizes of rubber, 3 16 and 1 8. The 1 8 I would say would be for flying indoors and the 3 16 rubber is for flying outdoors. Here's the instruction booklet, which is really pretty good. The only caution I have when putting this together is be sure you're careful sliding the wing panels into the pylon joiner. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more videos.